Hi everyone, so today we will be discussing the Lilly Ledbetter Fair Pay Act of 2009, which was first signed by President Barack Obama on January 29, 2009. The name of this act originates from the Supreme Court decision of Lilly Ledbetter v. Goodyear Tire Company, which was a case disputed almost three years prior to Obama's signage of this act. Ledbetter, being a woman herself, felt that she was being underpaid despite her hard work and dedication to the company for over two decades. Miss Ledbetter sued Goodyear for gender discrimination, which violated Title VI of the Civil Rights Act of 1964, alluding that the company had given her a low salary due to her gender. Goodyear appealed, citing a Title VI provision requiring discrimination complaints to be made within 180 days of the employer's discriminatory conduct. Because of the provision, the circuit court ruled that the jury could only examine Ledbetter's career for evidence of discrimination only as far back to the last annual salary review before the start of the 180-day limitations period. And this also meant that there was not enough evidence to support her claim because this did not fully represent her entire career within the last 20 years. Lily Ledbetter did not receive the justice that she deserved. So in 2009, Congress enacted the Fair Pay Act, which protected workers against pay discrimination and also allowed those who face pay discrimination to be provided more time prior to the 180 day provision.